Working with something as easy as what you think is the mandible or the jaw really can be quite complex. Uh, a lot of people look at a midline, and you can see this right here with the internasal and the intermaxilla, but we also have an intermandible. The midline of just the jaw really is here, but that is the suture of the jaw. When you're working with the Movement Lesson Midline Series within the Cranial Series, the midline point is really to the side, right? You see the difference of a right and left midline versus a just a natural center-based midline that so many of you think that is important. Why is this important? Let's say I have a child here that is looking at their mother, right? Do you see again that the, the, the influence of the midline? Oh, there's something on the floor, that upper and lower quadrant vision, right? Versus, again, possibly a drop jaw, and now you're getting the facial fall, right? I know many of you just want the jaw to close, but don't realize what's also happening is the face falls. I fall to look, I fall to look, or I have to now back arch to come out. Because again, this kind of mechanism of movement is not available to your child for whatever reason or the person you're working with. It could be, let's say, due to stroke, hitting out that part and you get that, or Bell's palsy. Um, it, it could also just be, again, uh, cannulation and so forth, that, or the child's having problems breathing because of an NG tube. But you still want those movements. Hi, how are you? Versus again, that, that very uh, dominant horizontal or vertical movements versus what? I don't know, of that social tilt and that really shows up in the mandible midlines. You can learn more about this in the Movement Lesson Cranial Series. This is specifically out of the Head and Sutures, but will also be in the Palette Series that'll be coming in the spring of 2021 or 2021. So you will be learning about this and more of the transitional milestones as well as how to do application for movement as well as the evaluations that I just showed you. Thank you and see you at the Movement Lesson Cranial Series. Thank you.